Here we are just in time for the best trailer reaction ever at the best trailer reaction YouTube channel. We try and. Uh, I didn't know how Leroy was going to start with this, but that's Leroy. He's, he's got that, that, that look on him because he's just ready for some good action. Uh, Marvel. This, this is my Studios. villain pose. Oh, we finally, get King pose, King. Just... we finally get to see King in action, so this is my villain pose. This is your villain pose. Okay. A deep in thought um, pose. If, if you want to see more photos and poses of Leroy, be sure to like, comment, subscribe. You can get that OnlyFans page to see if him do all kinds of great photos and, and uh, stuff like that. You like my shirt? It says I'm a trash panda. I, <laughs> That's I what my wife calls me. Shirt, <laughs> okay, there we go. Um, all right, let's get this on the road then and check out Ant Man and the Wasp. Here we go. <sighs> it's very good. I ain't have much sleep today. You need to be woken up. <laughs> I used to ask myself a lot of questions. Scott, you're at XCon. How are you an Avenger? That doesn't make sense. But everywhere I go, people tell me the same thing. Thank you, Spider-Man. People still need help, Dad. That's why we made this. Cassie! It's like a satellite for deep space, but Quanta. Wait, wait a minute. You're sending a signal down to the quantum realm. Turn it off. Now! Wait. Man, his hair is terrible. Oh, that wasn't Janet. Where are we? Am I gonna come down? Am I going to land? I should have stayed on the phone. I should have listened to my own mind. It's a secret universe beneath ours. What are you so afraid of? There's something I never told you. This place. It isn't what you think. I'm sure you hope. And give you more time. If you help me, so what's it gonna be, Ant Man? Not as big of a trail as I thought it was going to be. Well, when you text him, you said it was a teaser. I mean, I know it's a teaser. I just, I, I wasn't. So we're in the quantum realm. Uh, what's your impressions? Go ahead. I'm not wild. I'm definitely yeah. not wild. Um, yeah. And that's uh, okay. I've, I've definitely seen teaser trailers from Marvel that didn't wow me. And then the next trailer was like, oh, yeah, this was what I needed. This was it. So, I mean, that doesn't worry me that I'm not wowed. I, I think they're holding back stuff on purpose. I think we're going to get to see more of a menacing Kang in this because definitely as of if you if you don't know who Kang is, he's, you're just like, oh, he's just some dude that might help. If you if you don't really follow, like, oh, he's all right. He's cool. You don't necessarily know that he's a, a big time, he can be a big time villain based on this trailer alone, I don't think. And maybe that's on purpose. So maybe that second trailer is gonna be something. But yeah, this trailer's like, it's all right. And I was like, oh my gosh. Um, maybe, may, okay, so here's my question. And, and, and so we get the trailer we get a little bit of, you know, like it sets up how the, the kind of the feel of how the movie's going to be. Um, we see Hank 
we see Scott, we see Cassie, we see Janet, um, and we see we see Hope. Um, see Hope. Um, Hope's hair is bad. Um, I'm, I'm just gonna say it right now. That that hairstyle is terrible. Um, you got a budget. It's not. It's not the best. I mean, you you got a budget, buddy. I mean, like Kevin, Mr. Feige, friend of the show, pal. Really? Like, um, we're in 2022, and we're still having these women with these bad hairstyles. And so, like, it's to me now it's the little things because if you're messing up on the little things, I have trepidation for the larger things of how you execute the story. Does that make sense? And so this is a teaser supposed to be the, the, the best presentation of this movie, this film, this art, this piece of art that's commercialized that we're going to see in February. Now, again, in Feige we trust, I've said this before, I wasn't wowed and this is supposed to set up the next phase. Does that make sense? Mm -hmm. And I was wowed mm -hmm. by Secret Invasion. I was cautiously optimistic about Secret Invasion. I was wowed by Secret Invasion. Um, I was intrigued by Werewolf by Night. I was, but on this uh, the other side, She Hulk. I was like, huh, ah, wasn't sure. Yeah, that first trailer did not did not do it. And, and so, that. and that, and afterwards, we're like, She Hulk, give us more. So I'm I'm trying not to be that guy, but the 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 ideas that the quantum verse opens up is the negative zone, which, um. Also, Marvel owns the rights uh, to, let me see if, let, let, uh, I wouldn't be surprised if Marvel throws in the Micronauts. Um, I believe they still own the rights to them. Mm -hmm. And they're another version of people who can, who like, this interesting universe that they live in, yada, yada, yada. Um, I would love to see, it's a possibility. I, d I don't know where this lies. Um, supposedly Paramount has them, but there's no movie coming out. So I don't know, may maybe Marvel could have, because my thing is this, I'm all for the quantum verse or the quantum media setting up Fantastic Four because the Fantastic Four travels through dimensions, universes, which would be the quantum verse and the negative zone. The negative zone mm -hmm. also sets up a Nautilus. And a Nautilus is just a parasitic wave that just annihilates everything in its path. Um, so I'm all for that setup. I just, I don't know how this is going to come off. And I don't like that they held so much back of Jonathan Majors, considering he is the big bad for the next three phase the, the next two phases for the foreseeable future but again i'm 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 cautiously optimistic so i like i said this didn't wow me either but i think i might have more faith in it at this point than you do just because i think i, I probably like more of it i kind of like the idea that they held back on kang okay. i think I, I think we're going to see more of him i wonder if kang might not be an end credits teaser in Black Panther. And maybe we'll get another meteor trailer after Wakanda Forever. Now, well, see, that's just me with the, ten, with the ten hat theory. I don't know that for sure. But I wonder if if, if that's the case, maybe there's a whole plan of when they introduce everything. See, and th see, I'm, I'm the opposite. I believe that Fantastic Four is the next big thing. So I'm wondering if this uh, Black Panthers movie will have a teaser for them. So that that's what I'm that's what I'm banking on. Because if you look at the Easter eggs that were laid throughout all of this time, if you go back to Endgame, the seismic activity that was going on in Wakanda, or, go, or that 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 uh, Okoye was talking about when they had the I guess you call them the quiet council. I don't know what you would call them. Um, basically, you know, the last people trying to hold this universe together, they said there were tremors under the under the ocean. So that could have been one of two things. That could have been the Atlanteans or it could have been the Eternals. Because remember, the Eternals were going on 
And so it, which one is it? And now it's leaning towards, it probably was the Atlanteans. Um, so you're right. Marvel does lay these Easter eggs all throughout. And if you go back and watch, cause like, um, and I'd say this, James Gunn talks about, there's still an Easter egg in Guardians of the Galaxy, I believe that still hasn't been found. Um, but if you go back and watch a lot of these movies, you see Easter eggs for stuff long foretold, which is why people look for them so so hard. Um, if you go back and look at Thor The Dark World, you go back and look at some of the uh, Avengers uh, Age of Ultron, you see little little tidbits. So I'm in, I think they're going to go in a different direction and kind of tease maybe some of that cosmic stuff, maybe some Eternals, because we saw at the end of the Eternals, we saw Star Fox and Pip the Troll. Um, we, Harry Styles joins the MCU. Um, we don't know what's going on with the Eternals, but we know that they will return in some way, shape, or form. Uh, the entire slate of Marvel has been pushed back. Everything from Blade, Fantastic Four, to Secret Wars. So I don't know. I, I'm, I'm talking myself into this. I still just don't like sometimes these teasers, especially when they use this popular music. Like I like Elton John. I love Beyond the Yellow Brick Road. I, to me, that music didn't fit this. And well, maybe, let me. Uh, let me okay, you are clearly trying to figure out what your thoughts are going to be. That's going to be fine. You're working this out on your head, but we 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 only got we don't have thirty minutes for you to figure this out. I mean, we do. You don't. No, I don't. <laughs> so. While Leroy figures out what that is, we want y'all to like, comment, subscribe to our videos and when we put up new stuff. Uh, be sure to find us at YouTube and Facebook at We Tryin'. Also, We Tryin' y'all at Twitter, Instagram, and Twitch. And we out. Deuces.